Assalamu alaikum. Welcome everyone from our YouTube channel. Dear viewers at first click the subscribe and like button next to get the best videos and inspiration us. Today we will try to tell about. The Kirov class battle cruisers were a series of large warships operated by the Soviet Navy, later the Russian Navy. They were designed as heavily armed surface combatants, intended to project power and provide fire support to other naval forces. Here are some details about the Kirov class battle cruisers. 1. Background and development. The development of the Kirov class began in the late 1960s as a response to the perceived threat of new U.S. cruisers, such as the nuclear-powered USS Long Beach. The first ship of the class, the Kirov, was laid down in 1970 and commissioned in 1980. A total of four ships were built, with the last one, the Pyotr Veliki, commissioned in 1998. 2. Size and displacement. The Kirov class battle cruisers were among the largest surface combatants ever built. They had a length of approximately 252 meters, 827 feet, a beam of 28.5 meters, 93.5 feet, and a full load displacement of around 28,000 to 29,000 tons. 3. Armament. The primary armament of the Kirov class consisted of 20 P-700 Granite, SSN-19 Shipwreck, anti-ship cruise missiles. These missiles were launched from Vertical Launch System, VLS, tubes located amidships. The Kirov class also carried an array of surface-to-air missiles, including the S-300F system for air defense. They were equipped with 48 Vertical Launch System, VLS, cells for these missiles. 4. Artillery. The battle cruisers were armed with 130mm AK-130 dual-purpose naval guns. These guns were mounted in two turrets, each containing two guns, located forward and aft of the superstructure. They were primarily used for engaging surface targets but also had an anti-aircraft capability. 5. Anti-submarine warfare. To counter submarines, the Kirov class had an array of anti-submarine rockets and torpedoes. They carried RBU-1000 anti-submarine rocket launchers and six 533mm torpedo tubes. Additionally, the ships had a large hangar and a flight deck for operating anti-submarine helicopters. 6. Propulsion. The battle cruisers were powered by nuclear propulsion, which allowed for long endurance and high speeds. They were equipped with two kilonewtons minus three nuclear reactors, which drove four steam turbines producing a combined power output of 140,000 shaft horsepower. This enabled the ships to achieve speeds of up to 32 knots, 37 miles per hour. 7. Service and Modernization. The Kirov class battle cruisers served with the Soviet and Russian navies during the late Cold War and into the post-Soviet era. Over time, the ships underwent modernization programs to upgrade their combat systems and extend their operational lives. However, due to budget constraints and other factors, their operational status has varied, with some ships undergoing extended periods of inactivity. Thank you very much for being with us. Click the subscribe and like button next to get the best videos and inspiration us. Everyone will be fine. Awesome.